Hi, I'm Steve Frazier, and today I'm going to show you a demo of Weave GitOps Assured. Weave GitOps Assured automates continuous delivery and Kubernetes cluster management by combining open source innovation and enterprise support. Community tested and approved projects such as Flux and Flagger are extended with the Weave GitOps Observability UI, Terraform Controller, Policy Agent, and the VS Code plugin. Weave GitOps is a browser application that comes with the Weave. GitOps Assured subscription. It is an open source application that provides detailed information and real-time status of Flux applications. Weave GitOps supports basic and OIDC authentication. I will start by logging into my application with my configured basic credentials. Weave GitOps first takes you to the application page. This shows me my applications across my cluster. It sorts it by applications that are currently failing first, then by applications that are successfully reconciling. Applications in Weave GitOps can be broken down into two different types, which are customizations and home releases. Let's start by searching for the platform application, which will give us a tour of all of the applications that are included in the Weave GitOps Assured subscription. This is the application details page. This shows me all the information about this application. Up on the top, we have a sync button to trigger reconciliation. We also have a suspend and resume button as well. Below that, there are real-time status information, such as the last applied revision and an indicator for all the status of all the workloads within this application. Down below, we have the details page. This shows the inventory of all of the applications that are installed by this platform customization. The first one is the Flagger application. The Flagger is a progressive delivery operator for Kubernetes. It provides capabilities to perform Canary, A-B testing, and blue-green deployments. The second application is the Flux subsystem for Argo, also known as Flamingo. Flamingo is a tool that combines Flux and Argo CD to provide the best of both worlds for implementing GitOps on Kubernetes clusters. The third application is the Policy Agent. The Weave Policy Agent is a policy as code engine built on Open Policy Agent, OPA, that ensures security, compliance, and best practices for Kubernetes applications. The fourth is the TF Controller. The Weave GitOps Terraform Controller, aka Weave TF Controller, is a controller for Flux and it reconciles Terraform in a GitOps way. The fourth controller is the Weave GitOps application. The Weave GitOps application is a simple open source developer platform for people who want cloud native applications without needing Kubernetes expertise. This is the application you see before you. I have opened up my application repository. From here, we can see that we have a single application, which is called PodInfo, where we have a couple of manifests already included, such as the application namespace. As you can see, we are currently missing that Helm re release manifest. Let's go ahead and create and deploy this application. I will do this by running a simple flux create home release command and exporting it out into my Git repository. From here, we can see that our home release has been created. We are deploying version 1.5.29, and we have a set of values. Let's go ahead and commit this up to our application repository. From here, I will go ahead and make this commit. and commit that and push that up into our repository. Now let's navigate back to the Weave GitOps UI. Now that we have committed and pushed that to our repository, we can see that our application has successfully installed. It has installed 
the pod info helm release. Let me go ahead and navigate into this helm release so we can see the details. As a part of this helm release, we have a simple canary object, which is a declarative way to define a canary release with flagger and a simple deployment. We can see that we are currently deployed version 1.5.29. We actually have a new application release. Let's go ahead and bump this release to 1.5.30 and deploy a new application using Canary. From here, I'm going to navigate back to my VS Code terminal and to my manifest and go ahead and bump this from 1.5.29 to 1.5.30. Three zero. From here, I'll go ahead and commit this application release and push it. Updating application. Go ahead and commit and then push. From here, our application should be reconciled automatically and updated. Let's go ahead and navigate back to the Weave GetOps UI and see this kickoff. As you can see, our application status has now successfully updated to version 1.5.30, and we are currently deploying a new revision. Our Canary object has detected a new revision and is currently progressing through its Canary lifecycle. If we open up this application, we can see that in the Conditions tab, let me make this larger. We have detected a new revision and we were going ahead and promoting this application to the new version. As you can see, our canary analysis has now completed and it is starting to out the new release as the primary. Thank you for watching. For more information, visit us at weave.works slash assured.